the Tehran Karai region forms one of the fastest growing urban agglomerations in the Middle East and is a major regional contributor to climate change. Stepping back to the 1950s, the population of the Tehran Karai region has been 1.5 million inhabitants, whereas today more than 8 million inhabitants live in the province and estimations UN Habitat predict about 11 million inhabitants by the year 2025. There is a demand for the construction of 1.5 million new housing units per year in a country that will be particularly affected by the effects of climate change, where the construction of new settlements, consumption of energy, commodities and resources is rising dramatically. The Young Cities project is a German-Iranian applied research project that aims to develop solutions and strategies for a sustainable, energy-efficient and resilient urban development in arid and semi-arid regions as a contribution to significant CO2 reduction. The focus lies on contemporary, formally planned mass housing within the framework of the case study of Heshtgurt New Town in Tehran province. The demand for new residential areas is enormous in Iran. There is a high pressure on the residential development in Iran. And uh, the question, can we develop the megacities further? Tehran is the biggest one, of course. It is developing from itself. The next one near to Tehran is Karaj. Th this is one of the so-called future megacities. With a high degree of uh, population growth, a, a high de a degree of young uh, population who is looking for new households, for founding a, a family, and so there is a high need of uh, building new housing areas. سیاست وزارت خونه ما این بود که دنبال صنعتی شدن ساخت و ساز بره برای اینکه بتونیم که سرعت و افزایش بدیم. So it's a very uh, dramatical situation and there is a high need for new uh, approaches in building residential areas with less um, energy consumption with a high amount of saving energy and saving other uh, resources. و شاید هدف عمده این پروژه در کلان حل مشکل جمعیتی کلان شهرهاست که اجبار دارن جمعیتشون را سرریز کنن در شهرهای اقماریشون به عنوان شهر جدید ذکر این نکته and of course at the same time we have a, a, a high problem in the question of energy consumption uh, the uh, energy consumption uh, in the field of residential uh, buildings is very high in Iran and the prices have uh, increased in the last years. کلان انرژی بودن نفت و گاز فراوان و ارزون بودن در واقع نفت و گاز قبل از طرح تحول بزرگ اقتصادی کشور انگیزه ای نبود در بحث صرف جویی در مصرف انرژی ساخت ساختمان های and our approach to the cooperation was from the bottom up so we start with the technology they have and try to improve that technology. And the other approach was top-down. So let's take the best available technology from wherever, Germany, and go down, adapt it to the rain. من خدمتون گفتم در راستای همین صنعتی سازی بود و مشکلاتی که ما داشتیم تا مسائل خیلی زیاد یعنی بحث صنعتی سازی و صرف جویی در مصرف انرژی بحث اصلی کشور بودش و روی کرد به سمت فناوری های نوین ما بیایم با وضعیت موجودی که وجود داره یعنی با زوابط و استاندارد همون سعی کنیم که یه مسکن بهینه تهیه کنیم که اسم اونو ما گذاشتیم کیفیت برتر و یکی هم بودش که واقعا خیلی تکنولوژی پیشرفته بودش که دو تا ساختمان طراحی شدهش ولی in, in planning or building uh, we took the technology to have steel, concrete, masonry, and try to rearrange these technologies, make the details a little bit better. The main point was that we uh, uh, installed a kind of supervision from the German side, controlling of the building process. 
and uh, at the end a new quality really came out without inventing new regulations, without uh, using high-tech technology and uh, without producing too high additional costs. That is very important. We flanked uh, the construction of this building with measures in uh, capacity development. So we ran uh, workshops at the construction site and they were very successful. So we had uh, uh, people of the middle management of the construction firm and we had workers and uh, we uh, developed uh, step by step their qualifications so they were able to, uh, to do things uh, properly and uh, so we got a, a rather higher quality than uh, in other Iranian buildings. We made a concept for so-called mobile learning units based on 20 feet, uh, 20 feet containers which are very flexible to, uh, uh, to handle with a small workshop place yeah, with, uh, including tools, including learning material, any media we, uh, we need for, for qualification courses. And we will place them uh, at a construction site and accompany the production process. And uh, when the buildings are ready, we, we, uh, uh, we remove uh, this container to, to the next uh, construction site. It was shown that the energy consumption is only small steps of improvement, changing a little bit of the technology, arranging the technology, developing some new details. But basically what they typically do, we could save 50% of the energy consumption compared to a normal building. تمام زوابط، مقررات و استانداردهایی که توی ایران هستش تطبیق داده بشن و اجرای اینها صحیح انجام بشه. یعنی نهایتا ما بتونیم که مهر مرکز تحقیقات رو این بزنیم که این با تمام زوابط ما انجام شده. این پروژه در واقع ما تمام مراحل هم با تیم آلمانی هماهنگ بودیم و قرار بود که این پروژه مانیتور بشه به عنوان یک پروژه یعنی یک سری ساختمان مرجع باشه که اگر ساختمان های بعدی ساخته میشه با این مقایسه بشه که بگیم چقدر مصرف انرژی و کاهش داریم Another pilot project group is uh, a number of uh, new, newly designed residential buildings. That's the pilot project uh, with the name uh, New Generation. And in this case, we uh, are not only referring to the old, uh, already existing uh, regulations and rules and methods that uh, we find in Iran, but we are really uh, uh, trying to, to introduce some uh, innovations in the field of Uh, heating, of cooling, of uh, facade techniques, of uh, windows and roofs and, uh, and so forth. So uh, that's why it's uh, called New uh, Generation. The question is, can we develop a release for these mega cities as to be machines where people can't live in by developing new towns for, for instance, 500,000 people or 1 million people? And this was the question we started with and th said, yes, let's try it in a new town. And what can be the, the obstacles? Why don't these new towns come to the real world? Why don't the people want to live in it? Another pilot project is this plan for this 35 hectare area. Um, This plan is um, the pilot project so far as we uh, have involved and integrated about seven, eight disciplines in, this, in the elaboration of this uh, plan. And it's uh, a plan of a very, very high complexity. Uh, I would say, and we, we, we say that publicly everywhere here in Germany also, uh, you will not find many uh, binding uh, plans, the balance plan, in Germany of this quality, of this comp comprehensiveness. So it's really a, a model.
پروژه طراحی شهری در مقیاس کوچک برای اشکر در زمین 35 هکتاری طراحیش توسط دو طرف انجام شده و در توضیح دادم قبلا و هماهنگی و همکاری بسیار خوب تبادل تجربه خوب در طراحی این سایت بود ساختمون هاش هم آموزشی در واقع بهداشتی مسکونی اداری اینها طراحی شدند بود برنامه ریزی شهری طراحی شهری آب و فاضلاب حمل و نقل و ترافیک یا در واقع معماری سازه اینا تیمای خیلی مختلف بودن که همه با هم دیگه در واقع در تعامل بودن the best would have been for showing how it works if it would have been realized our plan for this 35 hectare area in Hashtgad of course we do regret from our side that it was not possible to realize some of these projects ما انشالله تلاش کردیم و تلاش خواهیم کرد که این پروژه با موفقیت به پایان برسه و یقینا میتونه دستاورد خوبی برای دو طرف باشه در تعمیم این حلال خصوص این که واقعا نتیجه این کار میتونه نه فقط برای هشکر برای بقیه شهرهای ما هم This Young Cities project dealing with a new town in this special uh, location but a holistic approach um, is in contact with other projects of the mega cities research for instance in the question of how to deal with energy in the future mega cities and we put in the discussion um, our proposal to solve the energy efficiency not only on the level of the single building but to solve it in the quarter context and we showed how this works I, uh really want to say and to stress that uh, the cooperation with our Iranian uh, partners on the different levels was very, very fruitful. Uh, we learned a lot from our side uh, and uh, we are uh, thankful for this experience. Uh, we know that in many, many cases it was not easy to uh, come along in this cooperation with uh, our side for, for many reasons, but I think we all together we did a very good uh, work. Thank you.